guys, welcome back to my channel. And yes, uh, we are right now on our way to the um, Royal Enfield uh, showroom in Bandra. Yes, uh, I'm going to actually uh, review a few bikes as you know in the description it says. So stay tuned for my journey and let's see what these new BS6 bikes have in them. Cheers and stay tuned. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Yes, we have uh, finally made it to the Royal Enfield store in uh, Bandra and it's time for us to go ahead and check out the bikes that I've just spoken about, uh, the BS6 models. Uh, they have three classic models, one Himalayan and one Chrome. I'm going to show you all of those in uh, these videos. Stay tuned for all the specifications, the feel of the bike, the, like, uh, the look of the bikes. Unfortunately, they have not got the uh, bikes for uh, test drives. But we'll, we'll come and do it later, someday, uh, sometime later. Sure, stay tuned. So hey guys, yes, this is the first uh, color variant that they help have. That's called the Stealth Black. Okay, and yes, uh, these are the EFI engine versions. Uh, the on-road price for the Stealth Black is uh, 2 lakhs 15 292 and it comes with the three years um, RSA and 30,000 kilometers uh, warranty. Uh, it is a beautiful bike. It, it has a very nice matte finish to it. Uh, I think I, I, you can compare it to a matte as well as a glossy because the angles when you look at it in, in a different angle, it actually uh, comes out to be sometimes glossy, sometimes matte, but I would classify it as a matte. Um, there are three variants uh, in this, as you can see. Uh, behind as well this is the first one uh, yes of course i love the black of course so then we have the gun gray this is the gun gray this is basically again the dual uh, dual abs uh, for front and back as well and that is uh, what you can see right here i love the saddlebags these are by royal enfield as well uh, unique and nice um, it's not like a hard bag but yes you can mount them and unmount them as you can see on the image this is basically the same variant of the Stell Black, uh, nothing much, uh, I like the visor as well, this is again an accessory from Royal Enfield, as you can see it's got a beautiful uh, visor here, uh, yes pretty much uh, same model, it's got the dual ABS uh, front and back, it's got the disc brake and the last model that you see right there is the basic black, okay and that's, this one is basically comes with uh, just single ABS. So it has the ABS in front because it has a drum brake uh, behind. Now this models come uh, in two variants. Uh, there are two colors in this. Uh, of course, uh, that's the black. And the other one, I've forgotten which one is that. Now you can, uh, there's a new concept that uh, Royal Enfield has come out with these two variant bikes. Is basically, I will, you will see it later as well. It's uh, the make your own. Um, I've, I've heard of make your own pizzas and stuff. But yes, now Royal Enfield has come up with that concept of make your own bike. Basically what it does, as I was right, rightly saying, it's right here. It's custom done easy, where you can change your seats, you can change the visor. If you want from spokes to alloy, they're happy to do it for you. Of course, at a premium price. Stay tuned, guys, and I hope you like this review further.
So hey guys, yes, that's the stealth black uh, that you can see, the classic 350, a very beautiful color. We're going to take you through uh, all the changes, all the new uh, specifications on this bike. And let's see uh, what all it has for the buyers uh, for this. I think the color looks amazing and especially for anyone who loves red like me, I love red as well. It stands out. You can see the strips, uh, the stripes on the tank, the way the uh, logo is, it looks amazing. So over here you can see there's not much uh, change in how the way uh, the looks of the headlamp and everything is. Uh, we've, again, they've got the uh, both the cat eyes over there. The only benefit right now with the BS6 version is if you see that the bike as we just started it, uh, initially if you have the bike turned off, if you can see right now, the, the main headlamp does not uh, burn. It's only the small LED bulb that burns. And now when we turn on the uh, bike, you can see the headlamp will uh, come on. So that's uh, like that's the new change that they have done on this bike. So guys, so starting off with the tank, you can see uh, the the tank is beautifully done. You can see the layers as well, the stripes very well uh, thought of, and of course the logo, the Royal the new uh, Royal Enfield logo in uh, red. It actually stands out from the stealth black if you see, and. Uh, I have no other words to say, it looks amazing. The heart of the bike is basically the tank and it looks beautiful. So they're offering the same 13.5 uh, litres, uh, there's no much change in the tank size, it's still the same. Okay, now going to the ignition uh, panel, you can see the speedometer, the orometer is the same, it's, uh, it's basically the same. Uh, over here you can see is uh, no much change in it. Uh, but the change that they have brought, as you can see, if you turn off the key and turn it on, uh, the uh, over here on this dial you have the engine malfunction that is right there, the fuel uh, gauge indicator and the new thing that they have done is the ABS uh, sign. So that's basically that's new in this part of the segment uh, for the uh, bike. So coming to the switch, uh, they are again the same on both the sides. Uh, there's nothing much changed on the switch uh, controls for the bike and of course the regular round mirrors that come with this bike. So getting back to uh, the tyre and the uh, this segment of the bike, as you can see uh, right now they're giving uh, reflectors in all the bikes. Uh, they're all reflectors, they're all coming with reflectors. This is uh, dual ABS on the front as you can see on the forks. Over here you can see the, um, right, right here you can see the uh, ABS disc and the sensor wire coming out right here. So that's new in these bikes. These tires are tubeless. Um, yes, they have come out with tubeless tires now where MRF tires are put on. And uh, they have uh, the alloys with uh, nine spoke alloys. And of course you can see the disc, uh, the, uh, disc brake is the same 12 diameter one. This is the other side of the tire. You can see it has the reflectors again over here. The ABS mentioned, yes, because as I told you it's a dual ABS front and back. Uh, this beautiful red strip that they have on the tires, of course I had to get my stickering but now you get it uh, directly from uh, Royal Enfield, so that's one more added advantage to it. The new change for this bike is basically there's no on off reserve switch anymore on the 350s, again they've got the fuel injection system, you can see the pipe right here uh, flowing from below the tank and into the system. So this is another change for the bike. Yes, yes guys, so we are going to check the air filter uh, compartment and you can see there's a few, uh, there's a change. Initially the air filter is to be just open. Right now they have a cover. That could also be because of uh, the air floor and the dirt hitting uh, the bike would be much more lesser. So that's a new change in this model as well. So guys, this is the EFI, the electronic fuel injector. This is basically controls most of your uh, 
bike sensors are right here so even if your bike is on a side stand and you try to start the bike or put you can start the bike but you cannot put it on a gear it will turn off so this is basically where it is controlled and everything has right here you can see the auto sensor that is uh, actually it is come on the 500s first now they are also available on the 350 check this out Uh, segment for the BS6 the catalytic converter basically what this does is uh, it actually refines the smoke and then pumps it out to the bend pipe into the exhaust so this is basically the most important thing for the BS6 bikes um, yes that is for the pollution control the new 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 addition to all the bikes so right now what we're going to do uh, guys is we're going to show you how this uh, bike sounds and what's the exhaust note so stay tuned So it's not that harsh, the bike is not that harsh, it's again uh, getting you to the standard uh, exhaust notes on the bike. Uh, yes, uh, not something uh, different, it could also be because of the uh, small little unit for BS6, that's the only reason. But I ultimately the bike looks, the feel of the bike after it's on gives you the same feel that the bullet has. So I'm, I'm happy I'm impressed with the bike. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you loved uh, or enjoyed the uh, show around of the Stealth Black. That was a basic model that I want to check out. Uh, I hope you understood the uh, different elements that uh, this new BS6 has brought uh, to uh, Royal Enfield as well. Uh, as I showed you, they have three uh, different uh, colors in them. Uh, two of them are dual ABS and one is not. They also, as I, as you could, as I said, in, you could also design your own bike. Uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned for some more fun, some more videos. My personal choice is the Stealth Black and of course I loved it because of course as I told you the uh, bordering, the red bordering or the red taping as red is my favorite color. The rest all is yours, do come visit. Uh, the bikes are not here at the moment for press drives but definitely come and see, look, have a look at the bike. They are amazing, they are, the new concept is brilliant and thank you so much for watching the channel. Do love, subscribe and share.